hello out there welcome to this tutorial on area of sector and segment of circles if you are just joining us check the description section of this video on our youtube channel to get the first video on mensuration as regards to sector of circles so here we go um consider the sector of a circle center o radius r and angle theta degrees like from the topic, we are interested in calculating the area of the sector and segment of circles. We shall be creating the segments for us to see later and how to go about calculating the area of the segment formed. Um, here we said the area of the sector AOB, AOB, the entire area is given as A equal to theta over 360 pi r squared remember in our first video we said this sector is just a fraction of a circle so the fraction is being represented by theta over 360 here and since we know that the area of a circle is pi r squared so we are multiplying it by the area of the entire circle to get the area of the sector now if you draw a chord from a to b we discover that this section here okay let's shade it this blue shaded part is the segment of the circle then how do we calculate the area of the segment of this circle it is very simple like you can see if you study it very well um, we calculate the area of the sector then calculate the area of the triangle AOB the difference between the two areas we give us the area of the shaded part so we just state it here that the area of the segment is area of the sector minus the area of the triangle so we shall see how to go about this as we solve some problems on area of sector and segment of circles so we take our first problem problem one calculate the area of a sector of a circle of radius seven centimeters given that the angle the sector septens at the center of the circle is 65 degrees we take pi to be 22 over 7 again now just from the formula we created we have the sector of a circle center o and the angle of the sector is 65 degrees and the radius is 7 centimeters now the formula for finding the area of a sector is given here now we substitute in the parameters we know the theta we know the radius and we know the pi so we have area equal to 65 degrees over 360 times 22 over 7 times 7 over 1 times 7 over 1 the r squared here is this 7 times 7 and uh, if we simplify from our calculator we have 27.80556 squared centimeters and uh, that is the end of solution to problem one since we are not given any degree of accuracy for our final answer we leave it like this so we go to problem two and um, for problem two a sector of a circle of radius 15 centimeters whose angle is 118 degrees it is cut off from the circle calculate correct to the nearest square centimeters the area of the remaining part of the circle um, we have the entire circle center O so we have our radii to divide the circle into sectors the angle of the minor sector is 118 degrees and the radius is 15 centimeters uh, we go through the question again a sector of a circle of radius 15 centimeters whose angle is 118 degrees is cut off from the circle oh this is cut off from the circle 
But to calculate correct the nearest squared centimeter, the area of the remaining part of the circle. Oh God! This is the sector cut off. This is the part of the circle remaining, which we are going to calculate the area. So we need to calculate the theta. That is the angle this major sector subtends at the center of the circle. So our theta will be 360 degrees minus 118 degrees, which gives 242 degrees. And uh, from there, we can now find the area of the remaining part of the circle to be um, 242 over 360 times 22 over 7 times 15 over 1 times 15 over 1 this is theta over 360 pi r squared so from our calculator we have it as 475.36 squared centimeters and we are to correct our answer to the nearest squared centimeters that gives 475 squared centimeters to the nearest squared centimeters and we have done justice to problem 2 we go to problem 3 for problem 3 a sector of a circle has an area of 58 2 over 3 squared centimeters if the radius of this circle is 8 centimeters calculate the angle of the sector okay um here we are not calculating the area we are giving we are giving the radius and we are calculating the angle of the sector so we have uh, the sector angle theta we call it theta which is the parameter we are going to calculate here and the radius is eight centimeters and the area of this sector is 58 2 over 3 square centimeters so from here we know our area of sector is theta over 360 pi r squared and the area is given so we express it as improper fraction and that would be 58 times 3 plus 2 it gives 176 over 3 equal to theta over 360 times 22 over 7 times 8 over 1 times 8 over 1 that is r squared since our r is 8 so it's 8 times 8 we make theta the subject of the relation here um, that is the numerator here 176 multiplied by 360 times 7 apply by the denominator here then divide by 3 times 22 times 8 times 8 from my calculator I have it as 105 degrees uh, that is exact it is exact so 105 degrees is the angle of the sector so the angle of the sector is 105 degrees so we move ahead to the next problem problem 4 calculate the area of the shaded segment of a circle in the diagram below oh god this is now the area of segment of circles we said from the beginning of this tutorial that area of segment is area of sector that is the sector AOB minus area of triangle AOB this triangle um, the area of sector here is theta over 360 pi r squared so I have my theta to be 70 over 360 times 22 over 7 that's the value of pi times 6 times 6 then minus half r squared sine theta that's the formula half r squared sine theta um, that will now give us uh, half times 6 over 1 times 6 over 1 
then sine 70 degrees so pressing our calculator i have 22 minus 18 sine 70 degrees is 0 0.9397 this is 20 minus 16.9146 from calculator i have 18 times 0 0.9397 to give me 16.9146 then finding this difference i have 5.085 squared centimeters which represent the area of this shaded segment of the circle and that is the end of solution to problem four we go to problem five calculate the area of the shaded segment in the diagram below leave your answer in terms of pi huh. this time around we have to leave our answer in terms of pi again since we are calculating the area of segment of a circle we have to calculate the area of the sector AOB minus area of triangle AOB so area of the segment is area of sector AOB minus area of triangle AOB so it is necessary sometimes to label your diagram so that you can always make reference to it easily so now the area of sector a o b is still theta over 360 pi r squared so 120 over 360 times pi since we have to work with pi then 6 times 6 minus half times 6 over 1 times 6 over 1 sine 120 degrees so 6 times 6 here goes we have 12 pi then minus 18 uh, that is 36 divided by 2 gives 18 sine 120 gives 0 0.8660 so this is 12 pi minus 15.588 if you multiply out this you get 15.588 since we cannot simplify further so we just put them in brackets squared centimeters in terms of pi so we just make it four significant figures and this is the end of solution to problem five this is the end of this tutorial i hope you enjoyed it if you do make sure you check the description section of this video on our youtube channel to get the link to the first video on length of an arc and perimeter of sector of a circle and remember to please help us share this video subscribe to our youtube channel until we come your way again goodbye